In this video, I want to discuss the concept of having no maidens. Okay? No maidens. Now you may have been uh, subject to one of these memes here. Uh, this is a specimen here which is depicting a very bald and big foreheaded guy uh, who is looking into the camera at an angle uh, with the text no maidens at the top. Now what does this mean? I'm going to give you an equation here where you will be able to find the percent based percent based that you are. All right. Now why is this important? This percent based is important in determining how many maidens you actually have. And we are going to calculate and see if you actually have any maidens at this time. This equation, okay, let me begin right here. Percent based, all right, percent based is equal, is equal to, let's use a different color here. Uh, let's use a, let's use a nice pink, all right? Pink is nice. Percent based is equal to success, okay? Success plus, let's use a different color here. Intelligence, plus generosity, okay, plus maturity, okay, plus attractiveness. Okay, now this equation was actually constructed uh, by a very important person for this unit. Uh, his name is uh, Giga Chad. Giga Chad. B. Sigma. Giga Chad B. Sigma. Now, Giga Chad B Sigma actually established this equation to help uh, common folk uh, calculate how many how many maidens they could have access to. Now this Giga Chad B Sigma, all right, he came up with this equation, and these values here, this percent based, this percent based is used in another calculation for. Right, used in another calculation, percent based. Okay, uh, usually this percent based will be written as a proportion, and it is multiplied by the world population, seven point nine billion, and this is equal the number of possible partners. Okay, success. The average person in their entire lifetime uh, will probably achieve nothing of value. Unfortunately, this is just uh, the consequence of becoming uh, the average person. So we have a success of zero. The intelligence is actually on a standardized uh, scale. So if you are average in, of average intelligence, you're actually at a zero due to the z-score, all right? The z-score, this graph here, standardized value is zero, all right? So if you are of average intelligence, you are of zero intelligence. And the average person, in terms of generosity, is going to be a very greedy fuck. So, we have a generosity score of zero.
but perhaps maybe I'm feeling generous and I'll give you a 0 0.0000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000
is at its maximum. It's excuse me, it's maximum. All right. Now at this maximum, if you increase the simp fee rate, uh, you're actually going to result in a net decrease in the rate of return for bitches. See, the uh, equivalence moves left, which means your rate of return for bitches is actually decreasing. Now, if you move your simp fee rate down from the maximum, you will face the same issue. You will lose out on your uh, return rate for bitches. All right. So in a sense, you must pay the optimum, all right, the optimum rate for bitches, B-O, bitches optimal.